Welcome back. This is Fox. This is going to be part two in our bowler hat production line, if you like. In the last episode, we went over, well, we started at the scratch. We worked out how many bowler hats we're going to need, how many we're already producing by byproducts from my suit production line. Uh, we then went and worked out which specialists we were going to use for each different section of the process. Um, yeah, and we set up all of the crop farms. So on this island, we are now making 192 tons of cotton a minute. Nine tons of corn, which is for the silos for the uh, alpaca farms. So now we're just going to slowly keep researching the items we need, building up the cotton production, and we're going to get things going. We're going to get the alpaca farms built in. We're going to get some town, some houses made. And, yeah, just finish this island up. Our end goal was 185 tons of bowler hats per minute because we we're already making 91 tons a minute. 91 tons of bowler hats a minute from our suit production line. This says 80, but that must just be because we're stalling somewhere. I would imagine we're full. Too many transporters, things are full. Cotton and everything is good, so that should come up pretty quickly. 87 yeah it was at, it was at 91 when we checked so we don't need to upgrade these still of course we do we've got windows here got windows let's get some steel and windows from one of these that's virtually full solve this issue quick and then we'll get to cracking I am researching some items while we're doing this some of the looms and stuff for the cloth production so it's these two you want this one's plus 50 minus 25 this one's plus 40 minus 25 so you get a minus 50% workforce boost from these two items along with the ferrous it's giving us a big boost. It's giving us 140 plus the standard boost. We are at 240% for the cloth production. 240%. We need 40 to give us 188 tons a minute. Happy times. So what was I doing? I was sending some steel and windows over here. So we can upgrade some warehouses. get things moving a bit better while we're waiting for that we'll upgrade these we set this little cluster up last time I've got the ferros in there already so trade unions camouflaged in there Got the ferrous and the optimized loom in there. It's just the other, the hop down loom, which we need, which will bring these down to three. So three twenty is a sixty one twenty. So we are going to need some houses. So we might as well start. We might as well start getting some houses in here. I'm not bothered about wasting markets and stuff. My money's so good. Just doesn't bother me, so we'll squeeze these in here like this. That means we are going to need some fish oil at some point. Is there a warehouse here we can pick it back off? Yep. We're going to need some bananas. Is it worth trying to squeeze it in this trade union? Might as well. I doubt we're going to need this many bananas, but why not? We 
We're gonna need some more steel here as well. Fucking hell. You can never have enough steel in this game. Good job I've got big production over here on this island. Oh yeah, five minutes. New world. Let's upgrade some of these that were struggling. It's all looking pretty good actually. I've got no oil. Don't believe that for one minute. We haven't. Jesus Christ. Right. Where's the Where are the roots and storage, trade routes, oil? Where's it coming from? Cotton three. It's coming all the way from there. We're not overproducing any oil on this. You know, we're producing way more than we need over here, so there's got to be there's got to be one of these islands that's producing oil with way more. What's this making? Yep, we can get it from here. Unless this isn't shipping out somewhere else. This has got oodles and oodles oh, spare. Really? So, penny farthings, jewelry, chocolate, glasses, coffee, gramophone, cigars, grass, grass. So there's no oil coming from here. We're just making a fuck ton more than we need. This is Investor 1. So routes, trade route, oil routes, Investor 1. Do we have a spare ship? We do. Suits. Load. Load. Right. That's why it was showing we were producing less than the 91 less than the 91 tons because it was struggling for oil. Everything's not being boosted by electricity. Alright, you definitely need upgrading. Everything else looks like it's managing quite well, so we can now get on with what we were doing. It really annoys me now that it doesn't remember your last research. It used to do it. It doesn't now. I don't know why. You have to type it in every single time if you're researching the same thing. It's a fucking ball ache. Right. Ball of hats. So we've got one cluster here. Cotton's full already. Oh, we're going to use this one, weren't we? Your ship has returned to its voyage. The fire left ruins behind. Should have put them up there. Your ship has returned from its voyage. I think when you needed forty in total, and we already had twenty, so.
Ferris. That's the power loom, not the optimized loom. And tell me I've left that. But I have. I might as well wait for this one now. Optimised loom. Grain Island, squeezed it all in there. Being boosted by Palace. This poxy little island here is making 108 tons of grain a minute. I love working with these small islands like that, it's fun. Good use of space. Need to increase island storage. We're also going to need some piers to ship all these out. You look at the lag you get when you upgrade these piers. Bearing in mind, I've got a 9900k, 64 gigabytes of RAM, and a 6800 XT. <laughs> Always makes me chuckle. Right. And storage increased. Right, what items were we going to use for the alpaca farms? Ferras, fabulous feed yard, and a fine feed yard. Now I know I had a load of the five fine feed yards, so we start on the fabulous. I think I've got a couple of them over there, but. Right, what do these need? Some stuff. Stand aside, boss. Don't get dirt on your fancy shoes. I won't bother with the rum, we'll give them the chapel when it's needed. Instead of dismantling the status quo, you perpetuate it. You gained racist anti religionist. We're in the presence of a virtuoso. Right, how much tons of cotton fabric do we need per minute again? 188. We are making 88. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Probably going to need one more row of these. We'll see. Spare a thought for us. We 
afraid, Nevet. I need the people to help themselves for a while. Why would you cancel my trade rights? It's not Our very kind. Enjoy I make up my own. Right, what are we waiting for? The cotton fabric's almost done. I'm waiting for supplies to come in, pick some up from here. In the meantime. We're producing enough, whatever it is, plantain things. Right, 250 tons a minute. Holy fuck, pig. Too many. We need we need to delete some. So I probably didn't need that row. 221 tons. Right, these are not zero workforce, unfortunately, so we can't boost them. Without there being riots and stuff. Still got to delete a few more. Don't really two hundred and two tons needed, two hundred and two so one more should do it. There you go, 192 tonnes of cotton fabric per minute is now being produced, and we needed 188, so that is golden. All right, now the ball ache of the alpacas, so... Now we're going to use fine feed yard, fabulous feed yard, and a ferrous. We allocated them for the bombing weavers, so... No, we'll put one of the bombing weavers down here, we'll start with the alpacas up here. I need to get a road over there. I've probably got more room than I need, so instead of squeezing everything in, 
because these farms can splay out the edge of this. We'll do this, so fine. Do da feed yard. Do da feed yard. Do da ferris. Got the grain and the silos. They all need silos, so yeah. I'm, I've very, very little experience grouping farms around trade unions, so this is going to be an experience. This city is a magnet for genius. Obviously, we want. We want them as far away. From the trade union as possible. These need four. One, two, three, four. So they need the solo, don't they? Let's start again. See if we can create some cunning shape that we can uh, stick to. How many tons a minute of this do we need? This is going to be very labour intensive. 188 tons of alpaca all a minute. Jeez Louise. And them two are making 20. So it's roughly 10 each one. So we need 18. That's not too bad. Look at that. Steel. Fucking steel. An explosion in one of your factories. The fire is out of control. This city is a magnet for genius. I might be able to squeeze most of these around one trade union, so probably don't need to keep creating these. So, what were the items we needed for the bombing weavers? Ferras, and then the two ones that you can get from what's it? Isabel. So, that means we can start researching scholar houses again. So 
Somebody was talking about um, the Facebook group having trouble with trains and not getting enough fuel to power plants. I mean, look, I've got seven standard oil power plants on this island, no double tracks, and uh, everything's hunky dory. I'll never do double tracks or worry about anything like that. They've all got oil. Trains are managing. Strange to me. I don't know what the chap's issue with. Anyway, we're digressing. Let's get back to the job at hand. Alpacas. The steel we wanted. I'm just going to send two ships of steel. Fire station. Fire station on the outskirts here. Two. That should deal with any eventualities. I'm not one of these people that will look on the wiki and find layouts for, <coughs> excuse me, find layouts for things. I just generally try and fit it into the landscape best I can. Seems to work for me. These are going to need a lot of these, it's looking like. How thrilling. A renowned personage we are now at 99 tons a minute. Christ, we're probably going to fit it all around one trade union. This is excellent. We need 188. It's possible. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Very possible.
Stele. Is. Five tons. Well, I don't have a flu station. Obviously not. Hundred and sixty two tons, come on, we can squeeze this we can squeeze this in here, surely. Uh, we ain't gonna do it, are we? Just not gonna squeeze it in here. What a fucking shame that is. Oh, I need more people. I'm running low and put the workers. I'm used to not having much. How thrilling! A renowned personage has arrived. Oh, I can't believe that. What a f fucking... I'll tell you what. We now have the required permit to expand the campus. I wonder if I can delete one of these warehouses. I wonder if I could delete one of these warehouses. This one and squeeze one in there. The only way I would know that is if I remove some goods from the island, see if these six can keep up. Of 
of a virtuoso. Once I get there, our warehouse is empty. We should be able to tell if they can keep up. I mean, we could do this. How thrilling! A renowned personage has arrived. about if I do that, do that, that. Means only that one farm can use that. I've got no road connection, so that's not going to happen. Get one in there. Did we do it? 198 tons a minute, we did it. Again, let's just clear the clear it out. Make sure that they're keeping up. You gotta remember they've gotta pick the grain up from the warehouse, drop it to the silos. Then warehouses, sorry, have got to uh, deal with the carts, picking the grain up, dropping it to the silos, and also picking the alpaca wool up and shipping it in there as well. So they've got a bit to do. We're in the presence of a virtuoso. Alas, my bowels churn a friend, and I must beg your expertise. Ideally. Um, I, I admire your. I mean, they are struggling, but I don't think it's going to break the production chain. I 
I mean, this road goes all the way up and through, so they should have access to all warehouses. It's not doing too bad, actually, look. I think it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Alive, dreary, and squalid. It's going to be okay. So only the odd one that's stalling every now and again. So that means we can crack on with the uh, bombing weavers. Now I'm going to put one here because it can it can get goods directly from these, which is going to help. I'm going to need a lot more people, but we were going to be using. We'd never turn on ours. This chap. This chap. And a Ferris. So he's turning it to Honolaros. He's turning it minus 50. And this one's a plus 50. So these are massive. Can't remove that road. He needs fuel from there. That can be removed, actually. This city is a magnet for genius. More workforce, which we knew we needed. to start supplying these with coats, whatever they're called, ponchos. We now have the required permit to expand the counts. But we can do that because we've got a shot ton of space. For ponchos they need alpacas wool, which we've got load of you can nick a tiny bit out of that so just gonna plop one of these down right we're making 42 tons a minute at the minute with those and we need 185 Leave that in case we need more houses. How thrilling! A renowned personage has arrived.
I've got the other chap here, that's annoying. If we have him in storage over here, I can't even remember what his name was. It was one with a red hat, weren't it? That's him, the bombing weaver. Hatter. Seven minutes, we're nearly there. See, we need more people, but when he comes in, that's gonna half the amount. And this is what I break my back for. Church, chapel. It's producing 128, so I need more. More bombing weavers. These are struggling. That road even need to be there. The land has to be prepared first. How thrilling! A renowned personage has arrived. Yes, it does. Producing 192 tons a minute, and we needed 188. So, can I delete one of them? Let's get another warehouse in there. This one would obviously be the best one. Just put him back with standard hundred farms. I 
192 tons. Now they should keep up. These are all good. These are all good. You're, you're dropping off him. Four here. We're up to our eyebrows. What are we at? 138. So we definitely need another cluster to get to the 185, but it only needs to be a small one, so. Should we squeeze it in here? Should be able to. If I'm supplying these people with enough stuff, which I am by a long shot, might try this with. The bombing weaver. Give us a boost. We're in the presence of a chap that changes it to John Alero and a Ferras. This should enable us to. This was uh, one of my islands producing me my specialists. That's why there's a shit ton of people over here. Seventy-eight, hundred and eighty-five when it is, so a couple more. Hundred and eighty-six, there we go. Let's clear the warehouse of hats and see how it goes. This everything should be running pretty goddamn near perfect. He's just struggling, but it's just because the warehouses were full. This is running near on perfect again. The warehouses were full. I'll keep clearing out. Till all the warehouse, it will till all of the internal storage for the buildings is cleared, and then we shouldn't hopefully see any of these red twizzly things, which mean that the warehouses are struggling. I'll tell you what, let's remove him from there. Him from there. Put you there. The game is you there. Now, all of these are being affected by that chap, which is producing the work clothes and the fur coats. Now, we don't need the fur coats because I don't have that many artisans. Most of my workforce is generated free from town halls being boosted by palaces, but 
You always need them when you skip into engine uh, uh, investors, so. Why not? This is all running sweet. This is struggling a little bit. I'll pack a wall. It's hardly nothing. It's Eight tons a minute less. No, this is pretty good. It's almost bang on. Again, they might be clearing out. They might be clearing out their internal storage still. So lucky we managed to fit that all around one. So we need 192 tons of cotton a minute. We're producing 193. That green bar is pretty much all the way up there. We needed the demand is 198 tons of cotton fabric. We're producing 192. That's because I've got slightly many, slightly too many bombing weaver things. We needed 185. We're producing 198. So if I delete one of these. That should, in theory, drop this down. I could probably even get rid of another one. Because I've added this chap over here that's boosted more of them. Yeah, 192, 192, 192, 193. 192, 192. We are done. That was a lot more fun than I thought it would be. I thought it was going to be a pain with the alpaca farms, but I'm amazed how many you could fit around there. I fitted one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen alpaca farms around one trade union. That's pretty good. I would imagine with a bit more planning, you could probably fit twenty. Got this big jumbo road in here. Look, everything's running shit up now. Storage is full again. This city is a magnet for genius. This is all good to go. And that's took me two hours in total from concept, thought of idea of doing it to finished. So that's proof of what you can get done if you need to with a bit of planning, a bit of pre planning. Use the right specialists, and we haven't even used all the island. I mean, it's a pretty big island to be honest. But considering this is going to provide scholar to over two millions worth of scholars with bowler hats, included in the amount of uh, bowler hats that we're making as byproducts from the suits, it's pretty good and well worth it. As always, I hope you learned something and enjoyed this. I certainly enjoy making these videos for you. Uh, the comments have been great. The channel's growing very, very steadily. Come join us in the Discord, as I said before. Any questions, please feel free to ask. As always, stay tuned for the next one.